let's test out this thermal image gun and here this is my uh, propane stove and you can see it's obviously showing uh, heat coming off of it quite a bit and we'll rotate around here and let's see here is my laptop and there it's showing uh, some heat coming off of the keyboard from a laptop well hey guys and welcome to solar cabin channel I've got an interesting uh, gadget that I think some of you will be interested in this is a uh, what they call a heat sensor gun a thermal heat sensor what they call a thermal imaging camera now some of you probably have seen uh, cop shows uh, where they have the helicopters flying around and they show the uh, guys being chased at night uh, by their thermal image which is the heat being produced by their bodies okay this basically works the same way however it is primarily used by people that are trying to locate a source of heat or a source of cold being released from some object it is a thermal camera it actually will take a picture and shows a thermal image which I'll show you here I'll turn it on and it takes just a second for it to start up uh, it has a battery and is rechargeable it does come with the recharging uh, cable it is rechargeable and will last about eight hours now there you can see the uh, image hopefully on that and you're seeing an image a picture of me which I'll try to show you there okay there you're seeing an image of me now on the screen on this camera it looks much better than that and I'll show you that in just a second there uh, but you can use this for uh, testing electrical, anything electrical where you think you might have a hot spot. You could use it on uh, engines, motors, anything like that. You can use this around your house to detect if you have a heat leak, uh, like from around a doors or windows. You can see where you might need more insulation in your house. You can use it outside. Uh, farmers can even use this to locate calves or cows that may be down someplace and they can't see them at night. You could use this to find them. So there's a lot of uses for this uh, for some people. I won't say it's for everybody, but I've tested it out uh, uh, several times here in my cabin to see how the image looks and everything, and it really does a good job. It has an excellent image showing you exactly the heat uh, surrounding any type of object or the cold if you want to look at it that way and it uh, it does store the picture uh, if you press on this button it will take a picture and then it will store that for later so if you want to compare it over time you can and uh, I haven't used all the features on it yet uh, but it seems like it's something that I think uh, if you're an auto mechanic or if you work with a lot of electrical appliances or propane appliances or like I do, I'm off-grid with solar, I have electrical uh, equipment, stuff like that. If you may want to check that out and see if you've got uh, a heat leak or possibly something that could cause a fire down the road. Or if you're a home inspector, an electrician, someone that works with HVAC systems, this will be a really handy unit. Now this is made by Goyojo, G-O-Y-O-J-O, -O -O. it is the G1 GW192 Super IR 192 by 192 thermal imaging camera 25 Hertz handheld 8 hour, eight hour battery IP54 related and uh, it says it's ideal for home inspection HVAC electrical and water leak detection so that those are the primary uses for it you may have a use for it around your house I thought I think it's a pretty neat gadget and I will find some use for it around my off-grid homestead here I can tell you it does have a good thermal image which I'll show you right here let's test out this thermal image gun and here this is my uh, propane stove and you can see it's obviously showing uh, heat coming off of it quite a bit and we'll rotate around here and let's see here is my laptop and there it's showing uh, some heat coming off of the keyboard from a laptop let's go over here see if my batteries show heat I've got an inverter on there and there it's showing that's my inverter on my battery showing some heat coming off of that Let's see, I've got a uh, power controller up here, a power station, showing some heat coming off of that. There's another power station up here, showing some heat. Let's see, my microwave is not running and is not showing any heat at all. And over here, I'm uh, making some noodles in a pan. So, uh, let's see how this shows up. Uh, the image is really good, too. Very clear. 
and you can definitely see the object and the heat sensor is definitely working good image uh, on this unit right here